Sounds good. Cool. Up a little bit. Let's crank that up. There we go. And are we get too far? throw headphones on also. Oh, Flu! Hey, what's up, buddy? How have you been? I know. <laughs> it's always been a little bit. Right? How have you been doing, man? That's good. That's good. this one so uh, I shouldn't say nothing really to complain about nothing really to complain about except for things that I do on my own Yeah, it, yeah, it can open. Cool. Well, what's up with my cat? Oh, I'm pretty sure it's my cord. Yes, it could always be worse. That's that's what that's I guess how I kind of look at it. <sighs> but cool. Good, uh, yeah, good to, good to see ya, um, freaking, it's, uh, it's just been busy, as I mentioned before, it's just been busy, busy, busy everything. Let me go and, uh, make sure that this is doing things right. Can I hear this? Okay, that's decent. Uh, any games that you've been cranking out lately? Anything that's been uh, that you've been fancying, or you just, or works keeping you preoccupied? Oh, I forgot. That's what I wanted to do. I totally forgot. I will try it later. Nothing over there. Okay, nothing there. Guess it's just this way. No okay, game just really tickled by <laughs> oh okay. I was wondering because I thought I remember when we were kind of uh talking a bit ago, especially since you uh that was scratching. That yeah, you put some. I remember since uh, I think you, when we were talking before, you said that you put some time into. What was it? Sea Sea of Thieves, and then like a kind of kind of. Not newish, but another version of kind of like a pirate game came out. I forgot what it was like something in daggers. Something something. Skull and bones, skull and daggers, whatever it was. I didn't know if you ever gave that one a chance or not. Yes, Skull and Bows. I guess that was what it was called. Oh, oh here's a brand. 
that flops so hard. Three out of ten. Dang, that is a that is a pretty harsh one then. Um, oh, that's right. I forgot. My brother sent me something. Uh, he sent me something along the lines of um, whoever it was, uh, a Steam family share thing. I I need to I need to remember to get to do that. Well, that sucks that it was a flop though. I'm not sure what games are kind of up and out right now. I know like everyone's losing their mind about Helldivers, which I have no clue about anything about it. I just know that people are just like, yes, this is this is the game. Is that open? It's not open yet. Do I go this way? Okay, I can't go that way. Can't go up. I already came from over there. Hmm. No, do I fall? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Oh, hold on. Do I need to put on the mask? Or oh, I had the mask on before, that's why I was doing it before. Or no, I don't have a mask yet. Starship Trooper Simulator. Helldivers oh, oh, Helldivers is awesome, Starship Trooper Simulator. Huh. That's pretty, that's pretty cool to kind of think of it, think of it as. Come on. There we go. That's loud. Yeah, is it is it, is it Helldivers or is it called, or is it Helldivers too? I, I'm not even sure. I've like I mentioned, I have no clue uh, anything about it. But um, yeah, that's been uh, good uh, good praise uh, from everyone. This one says mask. But I don't got a mask. Is there a mask around here? Can I go up? Oh. Oh, there's a mask. Should have to put a mask. Down? Okay, down. Yeah, held ever so yeah. It's, a, uh, yeah, it's cheap and really good. Hmm. Yeah, because yeah, there's very... Yeah, I'm seeing a lot of that. People are into whatever that... Or I guess it's kind of it's old news now. What was it? Lethal, Lethal Company? Which also is another one that I have no really clue about either. Oh, do, oh, is there something over here? There is something over here, isn't there? Is that a mirror? It's not a mirror. Hold on, I was, I was here earlier. Okay, so I can move this stuff out of the way. I thought I was here earlier. Or the last time I played this. Hey! Hey, I saw you. Okay, I can't go that way. It's shooting I'm not into the hole. Oh, that's right! Why did I even mention it? It's it, that's right. It's it's a like an SCP uh, aspect, like a horror game, isn't it? I totally forgot. Totally forgot about that. <laughs> right, pretty much anything that Pata would um, would would recommend is pretty much off the table. in here. Oh, that's about to, to do that. Hold on. I did this. Did I not save from the last time I did this? Because that portion of the game creeped me out. Damn it, I think I did. 
I did probably mess up and not say it. I got really bad nerves and jump at loud noises. Yeah, it, it's pretty much kind of a similar thing, but I guess I got a little bit more. I guess I got a little bit more to it. If I can just yeah, and that's the main thing, right? That's that's the main piece. Loud noises, like if I go and like watch a horror movie, like I used to in in the movie theaters and everything, I'll just close my ears. If I can't hear the build up music or or the loud the loud boom. Um, I can kind of handle whatever was on the visual other side, um, and, and, uh, and I'd be able to work through it. Like, I think, I remember when, um, I think it was when the paranormal activity movies started coming out, and I was like, man, this is really creepy, but then I would just close my ears, or I would just really cover my ears really good, and then I was, I was all good. But, but then again, there are those, some movies or TV shows that just really, really amp it up and, uh, leave your stomach, uh, stomach churning. Oh. Oh. Isn't that fun and creepy? Okay, so I wasn't supposed to see much in here. Oh no, hold on. There should be something. Is it? Do you have a? Do you have an energy pack? Is there an energy, is there a battery in here? There is not. There's a battery somewhere here. Hey Tasher, are dentists closed on Saturdays and Sundays? Oddly enough, and not actually, I shouldn't say oddly enough. A lot of them, uh, meaning is it, uh, is it the weekend for you? It is the weekend for me, yes. Um, oddly enough, a lot of times when um, uh, some offices, they're kind of like, version of staying open and everything is a lot of them will do um, the normal four days a week sometimes five and then they'll do like every like once a month they'll do a Friday and then once a month they'll do a different week that would be a Saturday just so that you can kind of hit those other uh, those those there's actually an office that's that's kind of in two towns over from me that's opened every single day they're open seven days a week and so like some of the assistants that I teach um, when they get over, when they get over to that, uh, when they, like, start looking for places, and they're like, oh, like, I have to work during the weekdays, perfect, there's this place, and they'll be open all the time, and they can work around a schedule fairly easy. But he's retiring, he just doesn't need the business on the next day. Yeah, like, I work, like, when I, uh, worked for, uh, one of these docs, um, he do it four days a week. He would do a Monday through th Thursday, and then um, and then once a month we would do a Friday, and then the weekend a and then the week after that we would do uh, Monday through Thursday, and then a Saturday. So you can kind of plan out kind of how those were to go. But four day offices are awesome. Having your weekend is really nice, but of course uh, your pocket your your paycheck's not going to be as big, but. It, it, it was nicer to kind of uh, have a little bit more of that family time. Do I need to pull this down or something? I do not need to pull this down. Exactly. They, they don't need the extra business. And once you get that old, you're kind of doing very selective work. Or once you get to that time of retiring, you're just doing more selective work. Got any vacation plans? Nothing. I know, um, was it called, um, was it called Spring Break is coming up for a lot of, uh, a lot of the schools. Actually, my kid's Spring Break is already pretty much done now. This is, this is the week of their Spring Break, but some other ones are doing Spring Break in the upcoming week or the week after. Um, 
and I have no clue. I have actually, I'm almost maxed out on my vacation time on my Usher. I'm almost maxed out on my paid time off. And uh, I kind of like, I like kind of like keeping it maxed, uh, just about maxed, because I can, um, in any case that for some reason I was not to be there, then I would at least get a little, a good chunk of change coming back to me for storing it and keeping it uh, if I was to get, if I was to leave or anything like that. So that's why I kind of like having it as a helpful, helpful piece. Do I need to go over here? I do need to go over here. Oh. Hidden door? Oh, this is the other side. Um, not, uh, not in, uh, mine rolls, uh, and it may just be a California thing, but mine rolls over to the following year. So that's, that's nice. Uh, for my PTO, it roll over. I max out. At, I max out a certain amount, and so I should just like take certain days off, just so that I can get. It, I can earn it back a little bit, but it's uh, it's it's useful. Isn't this a? Isn't there a thing? Where's the? Where's the tape? Over here, everyone gets around 30 days paid vacation each year. I'm telling you, Flu, just every time you speak about your place, it just makes it sound... It, and, and, and as Americans and everything, we kind of know, or we kind of know um, that <laughs> our system is very, very hard at work centric. And um, it... I want to say that's not healthy, but definitely it doesn't uh, doesn't make it nice for a lot of people that would that it would probably benefit for them to have those thirty days. But that is tight. That's pretty cool. Like our main thing, I think that's over here is what is it? Three vac three sick days or six six sick six sick days. Um, for mental health and such. I like that idea. That sounds awesome. Of course. <laughs> right? Yeah, that, that, like you mentioned, like, yeah, you mentioned that one, or, yeah, you mentioned a lot of neat things. Neat ways that they kind of have. This muffin tastes like crap. Alright, bring that back up. Okay, so that happened. But, would rather have a glazed donut than a muffin. Yeah, I, I, I am totally with you on that one. Except I don't need any, I don't need any of that. I'm already, I'm already on a bad path with, uh, with sweets. So, uh, I should, I should be taking it a lot easier. Okay, so that didn't help at all. Unless there's... Unless he dropped a... Uh... Oh, maybe I can go over here. Ooh, I can't go over here. Hold on, wasn't I over here earlier? Okay, I can't do that. Okay. Oh, so I have to just go and discover some stuff. 
until I can get um, the full set. Okay, so then where the hell do I go ne to next? I already went down that hole. And I gave it power. Have you ever heard anything about a YouTube family vlogger child abuse stuff? Are you talking about, um, well, it depends on which one, right? <laughs> Sadly, right, to hear. Um, YouTube family vlogger child abuse stuff. Is that the... Because there was the old school one with a family, Daddy05 or something or whatever. And then there was the recent one that where the gal was like holding the kids hostage and stuff like that. And she was saying that she got influence or had, uh, had help from like a babysitter or something like that. Or someone that was their PR manager. Just really, really jacked stuff. But I think they, for that gal or whatever, which I don't even remember the channel for that one. Uh, I thought she just got, I thought she just got sentenced. Okay, I gotta get up somewhere. Okay. Listen, I, I don't need to go back down there. What am I missing? I don't have to go down there, I can just go back over here. I'm missing a... And if you have a kid, the mom and dad has the right... Has right to 15 weeks off each with full pay. Oh, so that's that's a pretty good maternity and paternity leave, yeah. Especially, yeah. Especially with mom, a lot of times, understandably, that usually swings here. But the paternity leave for the dad... That is very different. That that's very different. We don't tend to have that unless uh, unless you're working at um, kind of the bigger companies, Google, probably Twitch, all those tech companies that are, are a little bit more uh, that are a little bit more uh, thought. I don't say even thoughtful. They just have that in their in their employees plan, which is super cool of them. Shoot, I mean, that's why if I could, uh, so uh, how hard is it? <laughs> yeah, how hard is it to immigrate? I, sh trust me, I even thought about that too, right? I have thought about that too. Would we be shunned for going to, for heading out there towards you, Blue? Pretty easy if you're ready to work. Oh, that's pretty cool. Probably if you're, like you, like you mentioned, ready to work or have a specific line of work that you can do. Do you guys have teeth over there? That's my big deal. If so, I think I might have, I think I might have something in my bag, my bag of tools. Oh, but you guys, oh no, no. Yeah, we're all at teeth, damn. Well, you know what? I think it's even better because I can go and take my, I can go and make teeth for for everyone. We all got bristles. <laughs> well, if I got oh why I don't have <coughs> something for you guys. Okay, where the hell is that last piece and part? gotta be in here and I'm I have to be missing it then no don't close the door it's the thrill of the krill <laughs> krill <laughs> Like, uh, like whales do. <laughs> Gosh, come on. Where's the... Where... Okay, I've got to be missing something. I have to be just blind as a bat. I 
can't pull that. There's an up spot over there, though. And that, is that what I'm missing? That I can go up there? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. anything to grab. I actually have not played Hello Neighbor. Um, that I I never even knew like really anything about it either, though, because I was like, oh, um, it from just like the cover photo and everything, I thought that it was like a mobile game, which was definitely uh, just ignorant me, just thinking that. But um, yeah, I never really uh, never ever thought to give it a chance because I didn't think it was uh, a, like a strat have any or have any strategy or anything like that but um, I mean essentially it's kind of I want to say it's like this but there's a lot of puzzle to it isn't there or is it just like a lot of just like speed run timing So it's gotta be in here. It's gotta be in here, and I'm blind. Those are two things that are definitely true. Why would they just give me that? Why would they give me this in uh, this part, and not whole video, and not open something? Close that. Is there something I can do here? Maybe I have to change this. No. Yeah. That one's halfway open, but I can't crawl into there. Can't see anything in there either. But that's just where the tape was, so it doesn't really do anything. Nothing on this side. Alright, I'm about to go and look it up here in a second then. Where's that second battery pack? This first room then? Where we came up from? Okay. Where is it? Where is it? Let me see. Apparently I just can't handle. I already did that part. Like, 
I can inspire for you to get an emulator. Well. Oh, which one are you working on? That's super cool. Where is it at? Where are you hiding? Oh. Oh, that's where it is? Or that's where, not where it is, but that's what I've been missing? Why? 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 Uh, I've been waiting, I work on PS2 and they even got working on the Xbox 360 one, really? That'd actually be a, a fun one to do. Like, the original Xbox and Xbox 360, which sounds like a... <laughs> like, it'd be fun overall to be able to play around with, um... Cause that would just bring me back over to the what 20 2008s 2010s games and all that stuff yeah that's another one that I actually wanted to uh, play too was um, was the what game was it um, rock band and guitar hero and stuff like that that's something I did want to do just to kind of get back some more of those musical games and everything like that I'll drop it yeah do so yeah I, I don't think I really even looked into uh, I, any or either of those uh, I remember a long time ago with with PS3 what was it the R, RCP3 and Especially on my rigs and on my computers, they really didn't like. They didn't work reliably at all. But um, it's been some time, and they've probably done some optimizing, and things probably work a little bit more solid. It's a big bear. What the hell was that? Oh, here's the battery pack. Is that open? If it's not open yet. Oh, I heard it. Oh. Is that Bobby Bear Hug? It is Bobby. Oh, poor Bobby. Oh, this is the upstairs. Been playing so much Skate Two <laughs> or Skate Three. Oh, that was my brother. That was my brother's favorite. Was uh, the Skate series. I remember them playing that relentlessly to death. Um, It is open, finally. Oh uh, yeah, we got power going over there now. Skate 3, that's fun. Long days, bong hits, and the skate games. <laughs> uh, what was it called? Um, I know, um, I have a PS2. I think I have a PS1 or a PS2 emulator and uh, was trying to play the, the classic, right? Tony Tony Hawk's Pro Skate 3. Or 
yeah, Tony Hawk's Pro Skaters, Pro, Pro Skate 3 or whatever it was called. Um, but I tried playing that, and I was like, man, I do not remember anything on how to do those. And I remember trying to get all those uh, things. I'm pretty sure I had, like, a game guide or I used something to help me relearn it. But, like, it's just not intuitive to pick it up right now. And I'm like, how do I, like, do my 360 flips? Or how do I do my, my um, all these different skills? Oh, skills all these different uh, moves and I gotta play it and actually set my control scheme to actually match what a PS2 control was like but just listening to the songs that they would have playing during that level that you were on I was like whoa this just floods back all these memories of being uh, of being at that time and I thought and it was super cool Oh, this is the restroom. Where's the toilet? Oh, here's another one. Every time I hear the offspring, I think of Tony Hawk. Yeah, offspring. Yeah. Super, super. The hour of joy. Yeah, it was super cool to uh, to hear those songs. Shoot, I'll throw it up. I'm gonna probably throw it up here right, uh, in a bit because uh, I'm trying to just show how trash I still can and am and will be. I heard someone laugh. Who's this? Pick and Piggy. Something that's gonna happen here, I'm sure. Oh man, even even just uh, even just yesterday, I was playing. I, I I somehow found myself. Helen, I thought you were down. I found myself playing a uh, uh, playing a a um, a emo songs of emo songs of the 20s and 2010s. As, and it was me and my daughter listening to it. And she was bopping her head to it. I was like, "Yeah, ingest, ingest the the songs of my youth, just like my dad did to me." So I got to got into listening to uh, System of a Down and all the other hip hop hits that he would uh, play. So I have to go over here. Is there anything? I've, is there? There's a third floor. Is there someone up there? No, not that I can see. Oh, there's another video to on oh, green. Do I have a green tape? I do not, but that means there's a green tape here. Did you play Def Jam on the... I did not. My friend did, though. He uh, he played it, and um, I think I would watch him play it at his, at his house when that, when that time... Or when he was playing it. What do I need to power? What do I need a power? I don't need a power or anything. The hip hop wrestling game, yeah, yeah. It was, uh, was it, was it, yeah, pretty much hip hop, like, and it was like, us on the streets, just brawl fights and stuff like that. Or no, or maybe I was thinking of, I think, I, um, unless I was thinking about the other one that was by 50 Cent, that was uh, more like a one-on-one on the street brawl fighter. One second.
One second. Alright, another absolute banger. The Warriors. I remember that Warriors game. My uh, my ex um, my ex's younger brother who loved the movie The Warriors. Um, I how I think I ended up I think I rented the Warriors from Gamefly online. And then he would play the living hell out of it, which was cool. And he like knew like everything. Like he had this, he had this know about and this know how of anything the Warriors. And when he'd play, he would, he would have some struggles. He was kind of young, but uh, he was kind of young. But um, it, it was cool because I never like I never I want to say I never watched the Warriors uh, movie, but. Um, he definitely had an appreciation for it and really liked it and I was like oh this is cool and he'd show me like how to do some of the executions or finishers or whatever during the fights and I was like oh this is neat is it over here? where the hell do I go? what do I need to what do I need to electrify? oh is it in here? oh there's a tape hey there it is Are you serious? Your green tape, Samuel Lee's last day. There you go. Ah, and here they are. Well, of course. They'd never miss this. You could miss the first who's going away. Oh, hello. Shh, 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 shh. This week, Dr. White here has selected our very own Samuel Lee. Yeah. The, the game is better now, than the movie? We well, that's pretty cool. Wasn't it Cyrus? Cyrus? Oh, no, I was going to say Cyrus the Virus, but Cyrus the Virus was uh, from Con Air, I believe. Which was another, anything Nicolas Cage, he was addicted to. Or him and his mom was addicted to watching. Is there something down here that I need to power? Is that what it is? Because I can't fall down. I know that's Bobby Bear Hug in there, but I can't do anything about it. Oh, maybe I can go. Maybe I can. No. No, there's something here I'm missing. What am I missing? Did you ever get into playing World of Warcraft? I should say, did you ever get hooked into? Where is it? Oh, is there a hidden one? Where? 
though. Okay. I started playing day one when it came here. Oh, that's pretty cool. My friend wanted me to get into it with him, but I was, but it was so confusing. Oh, I feel ya. Hmm. Yeah, with WoW, I never really fully got into it. No, I was just say that. I did. I did for my friend. That's all we did. There we go. That's where I was supposed to go. Oh, so this will lead me to Bobby. Yeah, my friend got me into it. And I was never taking up to raid or doing it. Oh yeah, same. I never got to do any of that. I went in, of course the terminology is weird. I went and twinked out at level 30. I shouldn't say that. I twinked out at 29 because if you hit 30 then you're in the second bracket. My friend ditched me in, in, to play in my gym teacher's guild. What the heck? What the heck? Very interesting dynamics, but uh... So odd. Yeah, I got to like level 29, twinked my Tauren Shaman, and just played whatever battlefield or whatever it was. And that was it. And then I would just do like the low at the low level rate just to help each other out. What the hell was that? Probably will be able to, but not yet. Oh, it's a time. Oh, damn. You did need to play in my gym in the gym teacher's guild. That's funny. It's different. Ben wanted to hang out more with mature and serious players. Oh goodness. <laughs> no, let me in. Damn it. Is there something I'm gonna miss if I don't look around for something? I feel like there's something I'll miss in here if I don't catch it. I guess that's kind of the same way that I felt about uh, when I played a lot of the games. Is that I would kind of just get into it just to play with them, but then they would just all just super blow blow past me. Whew, that one cleared, that one kicked me out. Can't do anything there. Oh, it's like the medical area. That doesn't look good. But five years later, he quit altogether and claimed and claimed it ruined his childhood. Neat way of looking at it. Definitely, there's uh, some people that get really addicted addicted to it uh, than others, right? But. Mm. When I got into playing Tibia, back when I was like, let's see, when did I start playing Tibia? It had to have been about like eight or nine years old. So it was like 1989 or 1998 and 1999. Tibia is what I played. And as a eight slash nine-year-old <coughs> playing Tibia, which is an online game with no sound. It was just pretty much really, really odd that me and my bro my, me and my my uh, I'll say my brothers, my friends got into it. But 
tibia really, I think, helped me with a lot of my, um, it really helped me at that age with a lot of um, my reading comprehension and typing skills at that time. Because, of course, I was playing with a bunch of people that are more than likely older than me and just trying to communicate with people and be quick at it. And especially it was a game where if you wanted to talk to someone or anything, you don't go and click on them. You have to actually initiate the dialogue. So you'd go, you'd just walk into the shop, type in hi <coughs> or hello. And they would say, oh, hello, what are you doing in my shop? And then you have to say, I want to buy whatever. And then they would just say, okay, let me know what you want to buy. Uh, what is your wares? And it was a, it was very, very neat. And I think that helped me with uh, with problem solving and and thinking through full conversations that I wasn't having at that age. And then as we went on to other games, like Ragnarok was after that. And then the, then he got into WoW, but still did Ragnarok with me. And that helped with other things. Oh. <clears throat> but then... Uh, I did not play RuneScape. My buddy did... Oh, you why are you looking at me like that, dog? Is he just always turned towards me? Oh, he's not gonna let me get his. He's not gonna let me get his piece. Uh, I didn't play the RuneScape. My uh, another one of our buddies did play RuneScape. <coughs> um, and he was he was got pretty into it. I think probably if I wanted to say like what game I super got into and kind of really did it alone because my friends didn't play at all was Final Fantasy XIV. Like I had friends at the beginning that got me into playing Final Fantasy XIV when it first came out and then we never played together and so I was just like well I'll just keep doing it and then I just ran through it and I was like okay and I, I was okay at it and then I like doing support classes so I liked helping people during their their runs and everything so that was a uh, that was probably my main thing that I, uh, that I like doing was helping all the other people um, I, I'm but that was but now that you mentioned RuneScape, RuneScape was the other option. That was the game that everyone else was playing versus I was gonna say Tibia was and Tibia wasn't like super popular, but it was either you're playing RuneScape at the time, or like my big old group of my big my group of friends, you're playing near the RuneScape, or you're playing Tibia. Hey, what's up Meps? Tibia was was very basic anything can run it and uh, anything can run it but there was no music there was no sound it was just whatever what tibia is and then runescape was of course like the the better version you have sound you have kind of 3d-ish models you have this it's it, pretty much the same thing as tibia gotta take an exam like 20 minutes out of school oh cool good well also good luck on your exam hope you uh, hope uh Hope your uh, your studying stayed with you. But very cool. Okay, apparently I have to go into some of these. But oh, which one? But, yeah, I tried playing Tibia again not that long ago. Is this going to push me out into the area that I was at a moment ago? I, I was. I tried playing Tibia not that long ago, and it was actually kind of fun-ish still. Still kind of really on my own. 
Um, but then I saw that someone made like a Minecraft, or they dedicated making Minecraft version of Tibia, and I was just like, super. Don't forget to change the game and just. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. You are right, Meps. I do need to change that. I didn't have a computer until I was like eight ish. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, it was just playing on my grandpa's uh, Windows 95 computer. I'd just insert the floppy disks, and my main game that I would play at that point was uh, Wheel of Fortune. That was that was where it was at for me. It's Wheel of Fortune. Um, let's change that real quick. There we go. Done. Boop. There we go. How the, what the heck am I supposed to do over here now? Star Wars Jedi Knight, uh, Jedi Outcast was my first video game on computer, huh? Let me check that up. That sounds, uh... I remember, yeah, I remember, um, yeah, even with that, like, like, somehow getting demo discs for computer games, I don't know how I got it, but, still the best Star Wars lightsaber combat, I like that, <laughs> I'll have to, I'll have to check that out and see how that one runs, I remember for a lot of those, uh, a lot of those computer games, yeah, it was just mainly, or my method of playing them was going to be, um, was going to be, um, demo discs. And for the demo discs on that, I think the main one that I remember playing a lot, maybe not a lot, but I remember playing it and it stuck in my mind because it was a demo disc that was just total crap because of how it, like, how it how it like introduced your, you to the game and it but it was cool but it was what was it uh return to atlantis i think was that what it was it was it was based on the atlantis uh atlantis um disney game or whatever where, where is it the Atlant Atlantis, the Lost Hills. Is this what that garbage game? No, it's this can't be it. Where is that garbage game that I had a that I had a demo disc? Uh, what is it? Yes, this. No, no, not that. That one's too. That one's too flushed out. Yes, this. Disney's Atlantis, the Lost Empire. Atlantis the Lost Empire. This game threw me through a loop on how it was played on the PC at that time and it was just it was just super odd. But it seemed like it'd be fun, but I never got to play it. Or I never got to get past like the first couple little uh, little stints of it. You remember the demos just for the for the uh, PS One? One of the games you had. Press X to walk forward. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, the demo disc for PS One that I was liked was like there's one that was for Tekken. It was probably like Tekken Two or Tekken Three. I think the other one was for a game that was I think it was called Final Fight. I think it was Final Fight. 
the other part of the disc would be probably Metal Gear Solid something. Of course, there was the demo disc that was for Lore, uh, for Tomb Raider. That was that also, and then something else that I like something else probably like a Monkey Ball game or something like that. Super Monkey Ball. Oh, I see. Uh... Oh, oh, so this is a different area. Oh, it is. Hmm. Okay, there's something else I need to consider on these. That door open? Good job, scare me, huggy wuggy. Hmm. Nope, can't open that one. That's the same area that I was just in not too long ago. This opens. What's in here? Help. Lovely. What's with this one then? More blood. Flies. Nothing up there. Uh, oh. Nothing in here. Friends forever. Okay, so what's the deal? Okay, so there's something else that I need to go and turn on that's closer. That one won't work because. Oh, maybe I can. Maybe I can just walk it over there. That might be it. Mm hmm. Okay. Oh, no. Nope. Can't walk it over there. That's going to take. That's going to need to go take it. They're taking phones. <laughs> you take it easy, Maps. Yes, thank you for uh, thank you for your time. Absolutely, have a good one. Good luck. I know you can do it. Hmm. This is going to be a tough little puzzle then for me to get. Oh, maybe it's that. Maybe I need to do that. I'm dumb. I thought so. I saw another one that I could interact with. There we go. Okay, cool. Can I walk down this area? Do I need to fall down? Oh, cool. Oh, maybe I can use that one then.
Hmm. I lost my power. Oh, oh no! I hope it wasn't something that's uh, system or I would say systematic, systemic. I hope it's not like the owls or something like that. That'd be something closer that I had to. That I'm not considering. Hmm. Okay. I need another look then. How's that going to work? Okay. So I just have to get lucky and just run it. Came in. Uh, can I shoot? Can I shot it from here? I cannot. Damn it. Open. Really? How am I going to beat this then? Hmm. Is there something I'm missing? Okay. Okay, that's what I thought I had to do.
Oh, it's catnip. Hmm. Through it. Fixed it? Oh no. But I was already up there. What's the... Oh, maybe this one. This is open also? Oh, it is open. Okay. No, this is open. Cool. Saving. Oh, good. I got a saving spot. I almost went full re. <laughs> It's one of these puzzles. Okay. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. Okay. Um, 
which I need to hit Q. Okay, this, so this will be an eventually part. The Miller side has both GameCube and Wii, which I never tried. Really? Oh, you just probably just you haven't tried the emulators. Uh, the Dolphin one seems to be, or yeah, Dolphin seems to be a pretty solid choice as far as uh, as a uh, emulator. I, I usually had good. I usually had good luck with it. Man, it is 12 o'clock though, and I am, this has been a really long day. Ugh, I'm beat. I'm beat. Alright, I already got it saved here. Let me hit that as an off. Can up, stop looking at me like that. Got some, sh uh, get some shut out. Yeah, yeah, I was like, got some. Uh, yeah, and let's see, it's morning for you too? Yeah, that's right. Uh, yes, I will see you later, Flu. Hopefully, hopefully during normal hours for both of us. Uh. Yeah, you take it easy, man. Maybe we can play some Def Jam later. <laughs>